The following contest is in the NAAFS National Amateur Women's 115 pound division, and it is brought to you by Mr. John P. Lennon and Ustream.tv. Introducing first, making her way down the aisle into the red corner, please welcome Summer Arthurton! Well, Greg Summer Arthurton coming in 2 0, Premier Combat Center, Disorderly Conduct, Omaha, Nebraska, all the way in from Nebraska. Won her last fight in July with the NAAFS with a knockout. That fight was in Columbus. Been doing jiu-jitsu uh, for about six months. Yeah, Summer's a tough, uh, tough girl. Just cage shot for her last fight, obviously. And I'll tell you what, she's uh, definitely somebody to keep an eye out for uh, in this division. But I'll tell you what, Jordan McDonald right now uh, could be the, the cream of the crop as far as amateurs goes when it comes to this weight class. So this big fight for Summer here tonight can really put herself in uh, in prime position to perhaps go after a national amateur title later in the year. So uh, this is a big one for her tonight. Yeah, this will be a good fight. This is one I've been looking forward to. Yeah, no doubt about it. This fight was actually put together quite some time back, and uh, these ladies have been preparing for each other. So, I mean, we've seen some of these other fights. We've had to mismatch and, and change some things around due to injuries and whatnot, but uh, this fight's been intact for a while, so uh, we're, we're looking forward to it. It's going to be a good one. Yeah, Jordan, the more experienced of the two, but some are coming in undefeated. music you hear playing behind these ladies as they walk to the cage. NAAFS Fight Music, Volume 1 and 2. Check it out on iTunes. And her opponent making her way down the aisle in the blue corner. Please welcome Jordan McDonald. Greg McDonald coming in 3-1, and one, Fitness Edge MMA, all the way up from Merle's Inlet, South Carolina. 1-0 in Muay Thai, 1-0 in boxing. BJJ Blue Belt has won 12 bouts in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu and 200 pounds and below. That's a statement considering her size. She says she trained very, very hard for this fight in anticipation of it. She is ranked fourth in the NAAFS Women's Division. Love watching her fight, and uh, I'm expecting big things from her, not only tonight, but in the future. Let's look at the tail of the tape, courtesy of Tim Lally Chevrolet, Summer Arthurton out of Omaha, Nebraska. Five foot three inches tall, 114 and a half pounds with a 60 inch reach. Jordan McDonald out of Merle's Inlet, South Carolina, five foot four inches tall, identical weight at 114 and a half and a 64 inch reach. So Jordan with the uh, four inch reach advantage, she will use it. We've seen her do it before. Yes, she will. And I, Greg, I agree with you. Jordan McDonald, all personality. What a what a great girl to be around and talk to. She's just a very pleasant personality. Yeah, she's got an interesting story too. Uh, was, was going to law school, decided to put that on hold to, uh, to focus on her MMA career. That tells you what kind of intelligence Jordan has. Yeah. So uh, obviously we're happy to have her in the NAAFS and here tonight, can't wait. The following contest is in the NAAFS National Amateur Women's 115 pound division, and it is brought to you by Mr. John P. Lennon and Ustream.tv. Introducing first in the red corner, she fights out of Omaha, Nebraska. She weighed in at 114 and one half pounds, representing Premier Combat Center and Disorderly Conduct with an MMA record, two wins, zero losses. Please welcome Summer Arthurton. Her opponent in the blue corner. She fights out of Merle's Inlet, South Carolina. She weighed in at 114 and one half pounds, representing Fitness Edge MMA with an MMA record. Three wins, one loss. She is currently ranked number four in the National Amateur Women's Division. Please welcome Jordan McDonald. This bout is scheduled for three three-minute rounds. And when the action begins, your referee is Mr. Jerry Chris. This is going to be a good one, partner. I was going to say it, man. Here we go. Jerry Chris in charge. Hands at home. Summer Arthurton in the brown shorts. Jordan McDonald in the camos black top. Jordan wastes no time. And that is her strength, is her uh, her ground game. Jordan pretty well rounded, but uh, this is her bread and butter right here. Choke. 
And Summer, for 100, excuse me, Steve, for 115 pounds, she is a very strong lady, young you, lady. You can, you can tell it right now by the way she's hanging on. Uh, Jordan was looking for top. Didn't really get it, got it, lost it, and they're, uh, they're back standing. Good job by Summer. Early on here, get this fight back on her feet. Good balance by Summer as well, as you saw right there. Jordan better be careful right now. She's uh, just working hard for that takedown, but put herself in a pretty bad spot. Summer gets it. Greg, as you stated, you're seeing some of the strength right there coming yes. out of Summer. Nice takedown. Got herself in a bit of a dilemma. Yeah, Trying to work out. For the finish here, she's got that thing tight. This is where Jordan needs to go forward instead of backward. That's, that's a tough thing to do, very counterintuitive. Summer wrapping those legs high as she's working on that choke. Jordan gets out. out of the choke. Watch the triangle. Good work, she Jordan McDonald. Body. She earned every bit of that position. Yeah, she did. And Summer, I'll tell you what, she's uh, she came to fight here tonight. She knows that Jordan is one of the uh, the more talked about females in the NAAFS Amateur Series, and she wants some of that spotlight. So uh, she's going for it here tonight. Jordan's got it. She's got 30 seconds to try to make uh, make something of this position, and there's the strength again. Great sweep by Summer Arthurton. You've seen Jordan work those legs up high. Summer better watch her right arm. Yeah, right on cue. 10 seconds left. Jordan going for it. There it is. There it is, man. She's got it. Oh, oh and there man. was the tap. We're going to see what he says. Jerry Chris says no. I think he said that's the end of the fight. She tapped. Is that the fight? She tapped. She tapped. Yeah, he's saying she tapped. That's the fight. Jordan Good McDonald. Call. Jordan with, McDonald with at the one last second, left. second pulls that off with wow. an armbar. A very tenacious Jordan McDonald we saw up there tonight. Yeah, great performance. And Summer Arthurton has to feel like she might have let one get away here. And here's, uh, here's a, a look at the finish. I mean, you're not going to get any closer. She tapped right as that buzzer was going off to end the round. And here's the transition. Very smooth for Jordan McDonald. Gets position, cranks on the arm, and right here, there's the tap. Fight over. Let's send it up to Jake Digman and make this one official. Ladies and gentlemen, your winner at 2 minutes and 59 seconds of the first round by armbar submission, Jordan McDonald! Stand here with the winner, Jordan McDonald. We saw two things, why you are a blue belt in BJJ and why you're ranked fourth here in the NAAFS. Congratulations on a very, very tough fight, tough first round. Uh, beautiful arm bar at the end of that, I mean the very end of that round. Anything you want to say? Yeah, actually I wanted to dedicate this fight to somebody special that I lost um, August 7th, um, Jimmy Chandler. He was a true hero and he lost his uh, battle with cancer. And so with that, I want to dedicate this fight to anyone and everyone who's ever been affected by cancer. Well said. All the way up from Merle's and like anything else. No, just I love you guys. I'd love to be back. It's a great promotion, and an all-girls card is a lot of fun. <laughs> nice job. Jordan McDonald, everybody, give it up. Coming right back, more NAA FS Cage fighting, Eve of Destruction. <laughs>